In today's video, we're going to be recreating the famous bass sound from the song Blue Monday by New Order. The original bass was made on a Moog source, which is quite like a rare synthesizer now. It had like quite a distinctive sound to it. The synth I'm going to be using is a Korg Prologue, the eight voice version, which is an amazing sounding synthesizer. The sound itself is actually quite simple. It just requires a bit of like fine tuning to get it sounding like absolutely perfect. So yeah, let's dive into it. So I'll see you at the synthesizer. So here we have just a blank patch on the prologue, just a saw wave. So first thing we're going to do, leave the octave where it is. We're just going to turn it all the way up. We're going to add in a second square wave and put the octave down to the very bottom. So we need to turn the volume of that all the way up. So at the minute, we've just got something that sounds like... Now, the real like modulation from this sound comes from a combination of using the resonance the cutoff of the filter and also the envelope modulation for the filter. So at the minute, if we turn down the turn down the filter to just below, we're at about 10 o'clock on the filter, and we're going to use the envelope to modulate the filter to make sure that it like closes every time we hit it. So we use this dial here, and then we can use the decay to actually like modulate it and make it quicker. So if I turn it all the way up, the amount of modulation. Yeah, we're gonna want to use about, for that dial about halfway. Turn the filter down and we're gonna turn the resonance up. Adding the resonance really adds to that like bite and plucky sound that the bass has. So yeah, that's basically the sound. It's actually really simple. It's just now tweaking the actual filter parameters to make it sound perfect. So that's a bit too like high pitched. I think we're gonna put the octave down slightly. So I just used this general octave button. So now we're in pretty much the right register for the song. So, so yeah, we're gonna make that a tiny bit faster. Turn up some resonance a little bit. Need to add a tiny bit more filter modulation. So yeah, that's basically the sound. It's really, 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 really simple sound. On the actual amp envelope, the sustain is all the way up. We've got no attack, no release. The decay is not really kind of doing anything because all of the decay is actually coming from the envelope that's affecting the filter. But what I often like to do with stuff like this is just turn the decay down just so it's slightly above where the um, filter envelope is going. And add a tiny bit more resonance to that. So yeah, that's basically the sound. So as I say, just fiddling around with these three dials, basically. So the decay of the filter envelope, the cutoff itself, the resonance, and also as well, the amount of um, filter opening and closing that's going on with the EG init button. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So I hope you've enjoyed it and I hope you've learned something.